Okay, I've got a joke for you. Oh, cool. Why do, why do fish not play tennis? I don't know, why do fish not play tennis? Because they always get stuck in the net. Oh, <laughs> good one. What's that sound? Oh, that's the bee marathon. You know, a long distance race for bees. My friend Bee Linda and I have been training for it. Well, I'll have to run in the Lana Marathon, but Bee Linda and I still train together because she's awesome. Oh, okay. You know what? I've been reading a book set in the future where there are no bees. That's cool. No bees things. <laughs> Actually, if there are no bees, fruit trees don't get pollinated, so there's no fruit. So in this story, Peony, who's the main character, wants to be a bee. Not a real bee, but what they use instead. Kids climbing up trees and pollinating flowers by hand. She lives with her grandfather and her sister in a little shed on a farm. But then her mother returns and takes Peony away from everything she loves to go and work in the city and things are really hard for her there. I've got the book actually, hang on. It's called How to Be by Bren McDibble who was born in New Zealand. Actually it won the New Zealand Book Award for junior fiction last year. That's interesting. What have you been reading, Ivy? I've been reading Baby Mouse, Queen of the World. It's from Jennifer L. Home and Matthew Home. It's about this a mouse that goes to this animal school named Baby Mouse. She has this bully, Felicia Furry Paws, and she hasn't been invited to this, this summer party because Felicia Furry Paws didn't invite her yet. Oh, but man. when they were getting their report cards, Felicia Furry Paws said, if you give me the report card, I'll invite you. And then she said yes. And then she got in trouble from the teacher, apparently. Oh, no. Oh, well, that sounds like an interesting book. Can I read it? Sure. <laughs> Thanks. You're welcome. Well, I'm going to go now. I'm going to run and catch up with B Linda and help cheer her on. Bye. Bye. You've been watching a Library Llamas video. If you want to see more great videos about books, go ahead and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to ring the bell to get notified when we post new videos. If you've enjoyed reading either of the books we've talked about late today, let us know in the comments below. Mm-hmm.